Hey everybody, this is Technoli, and today I've got a very cool device that I wanted to share with you. I know some of you uh, know that I've been having a tremendous amount of problems with uh, capture cards. I tried the Elgato HD60S, I tried the StarTech model that they have on Amazon, and problem after problem, and I'll explain that later. So um, I got this uh, company got a hold of me and said, would you like to do a review on our capture card? And I have to be honest, I never heard of them. Uh, Cloner Alliance, this is the Flint 4K P Plus. And it'll do full HD, 1080, 60 frames a second capture. So this is good for gaming. Um, it's good for, you know, anything that you want to capture on your screen. It will record. It is very cool. The quality is amazing. I've used it on the last, uh, in fact, one of the last videos I did. And I get full 16 by 9, you know, uh, screen. And, uh, you know, I got the HD... 1080p so I'm real happy with it but I wanted to show you here just what it is because it's really cool uh, it's different than the other ones that I've seen let me open it up here okay all right so uh, got some welcome things here a uh, little manual and uh, it comes with this manual and it has a little thing here to register it uh, there's a, a scan code on the back of it so you can register it and download the software that comes with it, which is really nice. Uh, you can also use OBS with this. So you can use either one. This is it. It's tiny. It's a little guy. And uh, really, really cool. So what you do is you just come out of your computer and go in right here to an HDMI and then go out to the uh, HDMI and go to your monitor or TV or whatever you're watching. But this is what's really cool about it. It also has a mic in, a line in, and a line out. So if you don't want to use the sound card on your computer, you can just use this for everything. And then this is a USB-C, which goes to the computer that is recording what you are capturing. So really cool little device, really small, like I say, you know. And on the back right here is that place where you scan to uh, get your registration started and get the software bundle that comes with it for free. So uh, let me show you how this works real quick. Now I wanted to show you what comes with it in the box. So it comes with the uh, USB-C to to regular USB 3 cable and then it comes with a HDMI cable to go from the computer to the device and then out of here into the monitor you just use your other cable and then it has all kinds of adapters that came with it tons of adapters if you want to plug it into a USB-C on your device it comes with this adapter it's a couple of those it's crazy. It comes with everything you need to get going. All right, here we go. Okay, guys, so I've got the, the little nook. I'm going to go ahead and uh, hook it up to this. Power. Okay, here's my monitor cable. Now, this goes into the out on this device. Right there. And then they sent me this HDMI cable. So that goes into here. And then that goes to the output of your computer. All right, so there we go. And then this USB cable, you want to plug it into a USB 3 port on the computer that you're using to record it with. I didn't even try it on a USB 2, but most of these devices require USB 3. And then just plug it into here. Now, if I go ahead and turn on the Nook, you'll notice that it is doing a pass-through right now. 
Okay, so I'll go ahead and boot it up. Now on the on the laptop, I'm going to go over here and I'm going to run, this is the software that comes with it it's called HDMI Cloner Pro. Okay, so there I am. I'll go ahead and boot into the computer over here. Okay, so there it is. So you're watching this monitor over here on your device you're recording everything on. So this is how it's done. So um, all I do is with this, this just outputs into a folder right here under videos on your Windows computer and it'll output whatever you're recording. So all you do is hit the record button and this is already set up by default to, to uh, record 1920 by 1080. So it's super crisp and clear and that's all you have to do. Now, if you want to record your voice with it with a mic, like I've got this little, uh, this little microphone set up here. Oops, sorry. All right, so I got this little mic right here, a little lapel mic, and it will plug into the unit right here. Okay, I'll turn it on. Now you notice it's got an echo, right? Well, that's no good. So what you gotta do is turn down your output sound right there. So enough with the echo, right? So turn that off right there. Just mute your speakers so you can't hear it. And uh, then all you do is just click on record. Then I can go over here to my little nook and do all my screenshots with you guys. And uh, anything, anything that I want to record on this computer will be recorded right here on this laptop through the uh, Flint. So... Uh, I think it's cool. I think it's very cool. And I didn't get into any problems with uh, copyright protection or anything like that. I couldn't believe the StarTech unit. Let me show it to you. Okay, so this is the StarTech unit. And it's got, you know, USB 3. It's got this connector, which is for like plugging in uh, RCA cables and everything. It has an HDMI, which I'll tell you about in a second. And then it has the uh, DVI connector with a VGA adapter that comes with it. Well, every time I tried to record just the screen on, on a Mac, it would come up with this uh, error that it was not, it was copyright protected and couldn't be copied. So then I had to switch over to this and then use a bunch of other connections to get it to work and it would record in VGA mode, but the quality was low, and it was uh, four by three, as far as uh, resolution goes. So, no good. $180, no good. Would not do the simple thing that I needed it to do was just to record the screens, whether I'm in the BIOS, whether I'm in uh, the startup mode, whatever, it records it with no problems. Now, if you don't want to plug your microphone into the Flint, you could plug it into your computer in the microphone input and record it there. All right, let me just stop this recording and I'll just show you here real quick that uh, it does work. Okay, right there it is. So there it is, recorded. I'll turn up the sound. Okay. Um, anything, anything that I want to record. So there, quality's on good. This computer will be recorded right here on this laptop. So uh, I'm real happy with this box. I think it's going to be great for a lot of uh, content creators out there that need a solution to do tutorials or whatever they're trying to do on a computer. You know, like we got, like we do on this channel, guys. And uh, it's it's a great box. It just works. Perfectly, right out, right out of the box. So um, I didn't have any issues with it. It's a good unit. 
Here we go. The Flint 4KP Plus Cloner Alliance Capture Device. All right, guys. We shall see you on the next video. And thanks so much for watching. Take care.